Gary Taylor probably didn't know he was onto something huge when he started Crossfire Paintball in 1991. But since then, paintballing has become the fastest growing sport in the world. And as the only paintballing company in the Rexburg area, wannabe paintballers are lining up to take part in this new and exciting sport. It's not quite like any other sport. You get to go out and hunt each other. Uh, it kind of hurts, but it's really fun. It's not too expensive. It's a good way to go out and get some exercise. It's very tactical. You have to maneuver and work teamwork, communicate with other people, and there's a lot of strategy to it, as well as just the excitement and adrenaline of being able to shoot and with no real consequences. As owner of Crossfire Paintball and longtime paintball enthusiast, Gary has noticed this new interest in the sport and has his thoughts as to why it is so appealing. It's like capture the flag and tag and hide and go seek all wrapped up into one. Anybody can play, little kids, as long as they can aim a, an air gun or a rifle, they can play. And it works for people that are old, retired, uh, anybody can play. There's no, there's no age limit, nobody's limited. While fun and exhilarating, paintballing can be dangerous as well. Cuts, bruises, and twisted ankles are common injuries that come with the sport. And more serious injuries can happen if simple rules are not followed. The only danger in paintball is if you get shot in the eyeball, and I'm trying to scare you. If you get shot in the eye, you will lose the eye. There'll be an ugly mass hanging there the rest of your life. You'll spend the night in the hospital. Your mom will sue me, your dad will kill me, and we will be shut down forever. Don't take your goggles off no matter what. Because of the risk of injury, Crossfire Paintball has set up policies to prevent those kinds of accidents from happening. We have a chronograph where you have to shoot the paintball guns over it. It's a radar machine to make sure they're not shooting too hot so they won't hurt anybody. There's a national speed limit of 300 feet per second and we make it 280 just to make sure it's safe for young people that come out and play. We have referees. We try to keep people's goggles on. We enforce the safety rules. We have a dead zone here where you're safe without your goggles on and there's no shooting in here. But even though it can be dangerous, paintballing keeps growing. But Gary and those who have tried out crossfire paintballing are pretty confident that if you give it a shot, you'll find out why it's the fastest growing sport in the world. Give it a try. Come with a big group of people. Have a good time. Um, I can almost guarantee you'll have fun. Very few people don't like it. Just one try and you'll be loving this sport because it's really fun. Really fun. You should give it a try. What's your name? You, people think it's more dangerous, but it's not really. I'm Brent Knudsen with Rick Side at 2004. Go.